Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to create a variety of different star shapes all in Illustrator. Rightio, so we're now in Illustrator and I've created a new document a thousand pixels wide and a thousand pixels high. And the first thing I'm going to do is hover over where the rectangle tool or the ellipse tool is. Just left click and hold and you'll get the menu up and you'll see the star tool. Now we can left click and hold shift to draw a star. We don't have to hold shift, we can spin it around however we like. And this is Illustrator's default star shape. So we'll, we'll start with that one, position that over there. In fact, let's just, let's give this a black color. And we'll just double click a swatch and set that as global so we've got our default star shape cool okay let's try and add another one so with the star tool selected instead of left clicking and dragging we can single left click on the artboard and we actually get a dialog box come up now we can specify radius 1 radius 2 and the number of points to our star now radius 1 is the outermost point so something like this and radius 2 are the innermost points. So the greater the distance between these two numbers, the more pointy your star is going to be. If these two different radius, ra radiuses, radii, however you say that, if they're closer together, if the numbers are closer together, that means that your star will be less pointy. So let's type 600 and we'll type 150. And you can see we've created an incredibly pointy star. Now we can left click again, we'll do another one. Now if you'd like to create something like a pentagram, you could type 65.5 for radius 1, 25 for radius 2, leave the points set at 5, and then we get something like this. So this is a very common type of star that you'll see, you'll see this on like ratings, uh, icons used on websites or apps or whatever. So a little bit more like a pentagram. We'll do another one. Let's increase the number of points to 20 with the same radius settings. We get something like this. Now remember what I said about the distance of the radius here. So we could bring these closer together. So let's go for 40 and 60. Maybe increase the points to 30. And you get something like this, a little bit more like a starburst or like the kind of shape that you see on products that are having like a special offer. So it's something like that. And let's do one more. Let's go totally bonkers. Let's go for 60 points. 500 by 40. This is going to be a bit crazy. And there you go. In fact, I'm going to move over here just so you can see this. So this is kind of like a, uh, a sort of sunburst effect with this coming out from the center. But there we go. There's a few different ways that you can create a variety of different stars and there we go we're done and there we go that's how to create a wild variety of different star shapes all in illustrator as always guys please feel free to leave any questions or comments down below like this video if you enjoyed it take care and i'll see you next time